Now let's add page numbers in Open Office. First, let's check. Do we have more than one page? Yes, we do. We're going to look down here at the bottom of the window. And in the lower left corner, it says page 1. That's the page you're on. Slash 7. That's the total number of pages in the document. And obviously, you can just scroll also and see that you have more than one page. So we have a two-step process here in Open Office to add page numbers. Go up to the menu, click Insert, and then you need to select Header or Footer. If you want page numbers at the top of every page, you'll click Header. If you want page numbers at the bottom of every page, you'll click Footer. I'm going to go ahead and select Footer, and just go ahead and select All. We'll keep it simple. That's going to add a footer at the bottom of every page. The footer is a special section in the bottom margin where you can actually type things or add words or fields, which I'll explain in a minute. So to finish adding page numbers, I'm going to go back to Insert on the menu, and I'm going to click Fields. When I click Fields, I see, you see you get a menu with some different types of fields you can add. Date, time, page number, page count, etc. What a field is, it's a little tiny, tiny, tiny piece of, of code, if you will. It, it's uh, a little tiny calculation that's put in the footer that, that looks at your document and puts some piece of current information in there. So for instance, with a page number, that field looks to see what page you're on and puts the number of that page in your footer. Let's click it and see. So I'm going to click page number. And you see it puts four on this in the footer here because we are on page four. If I scroll up, here's page three, and it has three in the footer because that code is looking to see what page are we on. Okay, I'm going to print that number right there in the footer. Page two is in the footer. Page one is in the footer. Now you've added page numbers in the footer in the bottom margin of the document. It Let's say I don't want it lined up on the left. I want it lined up in the middle. You're going to move your cursor. Click in front of the page number. So you get that blinking line in front of the page number. And on your keyboard, there's a key that says tab, T-A-B. So on the left side, I'm going to hit that tab key one time, and you see that will line your page numbers up in the middle. Let me go back, click in front of any page number, doesn't matter. And if I hit the tab key on the keyboard again, it will line my page numbers up on the right. This works the same is if you if you put page this works the same if you put page numbers in the header as well. And now when we print we will have a page number on every page.